Hey guys, it's JP here from Undead Soldiers Airsoft, and we have a review for the Classic Army M14. Start with the numbers. Chrono has 423 FPS. It's a full metal. Stock is ABS plastic. It has notable, noticeable seam lines where they connected it. On this one, the seams were breaking apart on the stock right here and right here. Probably from uh, putting this part in, because it comes in two pieces. So to fix that, we just put some electrical tape around there. It still got a little bit cracked right on the top, but it'll be fine for now. It has a bolt, working bolt catch and bolt. So you click it on there with this little button. Pushing the button doesn't do anything. You have to pull back the bolt again. It has a mock rotating bolt. Comes with a plastic heat shield. We have rails on here with dust covers. Because the plastic was horrible. It was a baby toy plastic. So I suggest replacing it as soon as possible. The battery goes in the back. You flip this up. And then there's two screws here or you can use this little dummy plate right here. We take off the screws because it's easier to get in and out. And I do believe this that just for putting it on your shoulder for like some support or something. The wires that came in here at first were horrible. They were small to big, and they had to small again to get extended all the way out there. They had just too much resistance, so we just took all of it out and made just one long continuous wire. So that issue's fixed. The, resist, the resistance is nothing, it's amazing. The rate of fire with a 9.6, it's pretty great. I haven't used it in combat. This is Danny's gun. We're not Danny, Matt's. And it shoots far with 520mm barrel. The gun comes with in uh, mock wood, odd green, or black. We did this paint job ourselves. Uh, Chris is rolling with the two. Overall, I do believe it's a good gun. We have a Harris on here. We have a uh, mock A cog up here. Just take it off so I can show you the working bolts. And that's it. Tune in again, guys. Thanks.